Alright, is that Love Clark? Look at my ha happy campy tent. Because when the sun went down last night, it became sukkah. And that means the end dwelling. We're going into tents, sheltered. Basically, it's a camp day. You camp for seven days outside and outdoors, and it's fun. Okay? It's really fun. I haven't done it yet, but I have camped, so. And I know camping is fun, so I know this is going to be fun. And I enjoy camping, so seven days outdoors. Uh, sounds fun to me. But my, my goal next year will be, I will show you what it's going to be, okay? I'm going to have to clean out this whole garage tonight, lay down a rug, a carpet. And this is probably where me and my family are going to sleep in here tonight. I got a big old carpet to, uh, I got a big carpet to bring in here. I got to clean this mess up, of course. Move some of this stuff and organize it. Kids' toy boxes and old TVs and a globe and an old refrigerator. Yeah, I can clean this up pretty quick. You're not supposed to do... Uh, the first day today is a Sabbath, it's a, which means it's not a Saturday. For people that don't understand. It just means it's a Sabbath that we don't really do any work. We're supposed to relax and have a enjoy the day not work but getting ready since I it caught me off guard um, it'll be fun for me to uh, clean this garage and get it prepared so to me that won't be work and plus because I'll be telling mostly other people what to do or I'll be putting on my uh, knee brace or using something to uh, clean up because uh, I got a messed up knee and back so it's kind of hard for me to get out and clean all this stuff on my own but I'm gonna do it and it's gonna be a fun day and uh, we're all gonna sleep out here in my garage because I don't have a tent big enough for all of us and we ain't sleeping in that wagon seven days now we're not going to be out here all the time. We're just going to sleep out here every night um, and spend you know, most of our evening. Kids have to go to school and I have to go inside in and out to cook and stuff probably. I might cook right here on this grill actually. Uh, and then I got a clue. I don't know about these collecting these brands. Yeah, I've never celebrated this holiday so I don't know yet what, what, what all we're going to do with it. But It's going to be fun trying. <laughs> It'll be our first time, so, you know, God forgive us if we make the wrong kind of step. But the point is, to, the point of these things is to, it, it, it's something that God wants you to participate in, but he wants you to think about what it is to get uh, something from it, to learn the lesson of it. And what it is, is Yehosha is shielding us. He's our tabernacle. Yahweh is our tabernacle. And, he, and, and for these seven days, that's what he's going to be doing, is being our tabernacle. And, and, and as to represent them coming out of Egypt and with the, um, with the uh, pillar by day and the pillar by night, okay? And the light by day and the light by night or whatever it was, right? That followed them everywhere. That that was Yahweh, and this is what the tents will represent. It's about the forty. It's about the forty years in the wilderness. It's, it has some symbology with that being freed from Egypt, and it's supposed to represent our freedom from other nations. Okay, that's what it's so, supposed to represent. So, uh, you know, it's totally against the new world order, I guess. <laughs> Globalism, um, one world government. <laughs> I don't know how you can have one world government in different nations, but anyway, I guess it comes down to ethnicity at that point. Um, but so, um, so yeah, this is the 
the indwelling period and it, it lasts for seven days and um, we're going to try to participate and be our first time so if we don't get everything right y'all yeah, forgive us because it's our integrity that matters and it's the lesson that really counts in the end in the long run okay is that love clark and you know who wouldn't enjoy i mean who can't enjoy it think about it if, if you would like to reject these holidays and just say they're jewish they're not just jewish they're for all israel including people that identify with israel uh, christian identity okay what i'm saying is people that believe in british israelitism and stuff like that okay that the ten tribes <coughs> are in fact Europeans the lost tribes are European okay but my point is anyone it doesn't matter what race you are anyone that likes camping I mean who wouldn't want to have seven days of camping outdoors and enjoy that how count I mean how can why are you embrace Christmas and Easter and these silly you know well you know these uh, holidays and start embracing the real the real uh, parties God made. And one of them, guys, is seven days of camping. How awesome is that? All right? Is that Love Clark? Love you guys and enjoy your camp if you're going to do it. And um, I hope that you guys learn from me, maybe, what you can do. Okay, because I'm learning on my own as well, so we can learn together, alright? Love you guys, love.